And what are those five resolutions? The five resolutions, the first one, uh, the uh, said uh, none of the 20 baptized and none of the uh, the 300 catchments mm -hmm. and which could change his or her faith. So that was the, a total commitment to that's the That's the total faith. commitment. Okay. Then uh, they didn't stop there. They the found same. a way. How could they really keep this what, resolution? So one uh, that they decided, they resolved mm -hmm. to know each other. Okay. Two, to uh, love each other, mm -hmm. to help each other and to pray for each other. Mm -hmm. So that was the resolution one. Mm -hmm. Resolution number two? Resolution number two seemed almost madness because if you as they were, they said we shall have to convert most of the people of Buganda and most of the people of the rest, uh, the rest of, the, of the other tribes around of Uganda to Catholicism. So they gave, to, they committed themselves to being the missionaries. The missionaries. Of the whole region. Of the whole region. That is quite a tough yes. decision. To and take. they took uh, a very, very uh, strategic method. Mm -hmm. uh, they shared, they shared the work. They gave St. Joseph Barikudembe, who was the advisor of the king, to be in charge of converting the people uh, in the palace. Okay. Now, so Joseph Mukasa mm -hmm. and uh, John Mary Muse. Then outside the country, the, 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 the Paris, uh, the Andrew Kagwa, Adolf Mukasa Rodigo, were in church. This was an expansion plan. An expansion plan. Okay. So uh, also the all the villages around uh, around the uh, Kampa mm -hmm. were, were also uh, given to Saint Andrew Kagwa, and his became the mission, his house. So they were using their homes yes. to teach and yes. to convert other people yes. in the absence of the missionaries. In the absence of the mission. What is the fourth resolution? Then the no, not the fourth. There is what uh, outside outside the, country, the rest of the country mm -hmm. and beyond Buganda, uh, that was in charge of uh, St. Uh, Matthias Murumba, Lok Banaba and Noah Mohagali. So that was his area. And soon uh, he opened up stations. So for example, he opened up one in Bolemezi, how One, far is that from eight, Kampala? From Kampala, 80 kilometers, uh, 80 miles. And they were traveling on foot? On foot. And uh, also another one uh, in uh, at Mukono, that mm -hmm. is 60 miles. Mm -hmm. And then at Masaka, that's, that's uh, 100 miles. That's right. Yes, not kilometers, but miles. So those are the, uh, the station they had opened. By the time the missionaries came, they were trying to open more. But at the time the missionaries came, they using this method, they found out that they had converted uh, 80,000 and they were now the leading. When the missionaries left, that you was had about 320 altogether yes, Catholics. Yes. Uh, Protestants, 60,000. Okay. Now, by and the time the missionaries returned, how yes. many years was that? Uh, to about two, two years. Within a span of two years, yes. they had converted the priest across to 80,000? 80, 80,000, they were the leading. Okay. Now they had more Catholics than they had the Protestants. Yes, the that's and, uh, uh, and that they had uh, like that. And then uh, the other one, they said, we must uh, convince the king, mm -hmm. uh, the chiefs, and uh, uh, also the other people that the Catholicism is good. Then said, how should we do this? Said you should be the example. 
So they gave themselves as the example, the example. of the beauty, beauty of Catholicism. Of Catholicism. And so how that, did they do that? Uh, so that they, they would be obedient to the king, mm -hmm. obedient to the, to the chiefs, uh, kind and trustworthy of the people in whatever they do. And uh, they said they would do, uh, each one would do his or her own work as perfectly as possible so that other people would love the Christianity. That's why uh, they got so many. So those are the resolutions that the resolution, the that's num number four. Oh, okay. Yes, number number five, num number three. Then number four, uh, see, they said well, we must convince the king so that he brings back the missionaries. Mm -hmm. That job was given to St. Joseph Mukasa Balikudembe. He did it, but he was also a, an advisor to the king. Yes, he did it, but he succeeded the next king. So he was the kind of Henry Kissinger. Yeah, the, the <laughs> that's king. right. That's right. Well, that's very good. So the last one and one of the most important, they said, we don't know enough religion. What we have to do is to go to Tanzania to Bukumbi, send mm -hmm. people, learn the region, come back and teach. So, so they, they were choosing. We are choosing members from delegates from each village to go one. there from 60 to 100 members. Go study for a month, come back. Then the next month, they would select others of the same. Go and run, and then they expand it like that. Oh, that is remarkable. Yes. So, uh, looking, we don't have the map of East Africa, oh, but no. people who might have access to it, you can see this is sailing from Kampala to Mwanza, yes. which is the longest it, span of the Lake Victoria. It right? took them, usually, to, it usually took them uh, about 30 days a month now, okay. to travel on with their own canoes. In the canoes. canoes. Okay. How do they get into travel and finally the execution? Uh, this is where the making of matters Yes. It really comes. We want to get into that. And that was with, the, first of all, with Joseph Mukasa. Mm -hmm. uh, Joseph Mukasa, uh, when he was coming from Tanzania, say, for example, uh, he had, they had a, uh, uh, their, uh, their parish priest, mm -hmm. uh, Livignac, uh, had been consecrated a bishop. Okay. Bishop of uh, part of Uganda, part of Tanzania mm. and part of Zaire. Mm. So uh, when he came from there, there was a burning point of killing Bishop Huntington. Bishop Huntington, the Protestant bishop. Mm -hmm. And uh, as he was an advisor, he told the king, please, don't kill that white man. Your father did not kill any white man. Leave him. He knew that uh, if he had said that word, uh, he would be killed. But he said, even though I'm killed, as long as I save the okay. life of that um, white man, it would be okay. That was one. Okay. Then another reason, he was the leader of the region. Then he started. So the king got mad because Joseph Mukasabali Kudembe yes. kind of stood up Yes. To, he, to the king, which you are not supposed to do. Yeah, that's right. During those days. Uh -huh. All right. Now, then... And he was a leader of, and he was of, a leader. of all the Christians. Now, getting into the banning of these new Catholics at yes. Namugongo, yes. uh, what was the story, in brief? Kind of? uh, in brief, uh, probably I don't know uh, whether it would be good to... Uh, they killed Joseph Makasa on the 15th uh, November 1885, it was Sunday. Mm -hmm. Then probably would think that people would fear. Then that very night, uh, many uh, catechumens went to the, uh, to the parish and 16 of them were baptized. Mm 